Hi guys, in this video I am going to discuss what program to reverse an array. Suppose I enter the number 6, then I have to enter 6 elements into the array. Uh, first I enter 5, 9, 3, 9, 3, 8. Then after reverse of array elements, it's a uh, display 8, 3, 9, 3, 9, 5. So right here 8 is the uh, in lost, so it's come first. And 3, second lost. So it comes second first like this on uh, nine three nine five. Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So, if you debug the code, control comes to main function. Here, after that, go inside. So, right here, I've taken a uh, five integer variable. First is i. Next, o j. And next, n. Here, after tamp. And next. A double R. So right here I have given uh, size 25. So you can add 25 elements in the array. So if you give uh, more than 25, then the exception curve uh, index array auto bond. So hereafter control comes to this point. So I enter, enter the number. So this or uh, display into the output screen. So whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by n. So I'm going to enter n value 5. So hereafter i start from 0 and uh, that check the condition i less than n value 5 i enter. So 0 less than 5 condition is true so that go inside. So right here this all display into the output screen and a double out of 0 position. So let's enter the number I am going to enter 4 
and here after that go up and increase the value of i so i become one check the condition one less than five condition is true so at here one position so this all display into the output screen and at here a double out of one position i'm going to enter nine and here after i gonna increase by one so i become two now check the condition two less than five condition is true so i at here at two position i'm going to enter five so here after again the i value increase by one so i become three now check the condition three less than five condition is true so that coincides so this or display into the output screen and a double or three position i'm going to enter or uh, seven and here after i gonna increase by one so i become four now check the condition four less than five condition is true so this or display into the output screen so a double or four position i'm going to enter or uh, eleven and here after that go up increase the value of i so i become 5 now uh, so at here check the condition 5 less than 5 so n value is 5 so 5 less than 5 condition is not true so that not go inside so control comes to this point uh, so at here i am going to do a double r so Uh, 0 position 4 is there 4 9 5 here after 7 and 11 so 0 position 4 is there 1 position 9 2 3 and 4 now j equal to i minus 1 so i value is now uh, 5 5 minus 1 or uh, 4 so j is now 4 here after i start from 0 again or uh, check the condition 0 less than 4 the condition is true so that coincide so a double out of 0 position or uh, that go to tam so 0 position what we have or uh, 4 that go to tam now here after a double r of so j value is now 4 so 4 position value go to a double r of 0 so at here or uh, 11 that go to 0 position and uh, next tam go to a double r of 4 position so j value is 4 so tam value is now uh, 4 that go to 4, uh, 4 position so time value is 4 that go to 4 position so here after on new array elements so first position 11 next 9 next 5 7 and 4 so this is a 0 1 2 3 and 4 here after j minus minus so j decrease by 1 so j become 3 now that go up and increase the value of i so i become 1 check the condition 1 less than or uh, uh, j value is uh, 3 so 1 less than 3 condition is true so that coincides so a double out of i so 1 position value go to tan so 1 position 9 is there 9 go to tan and a double out of j so j is now 3 or uh, 3 position value go to a double out of 1 so 3 position 7 is there so 7 go to a double out of 1 and on next tam go to a double out of 3 position so tam is now 9 so that go to 3 position so this go to 3 position now here after new area elements so 11 now 7 come to first position here after uh, 5 and now 9 go to 3 position and next 11 so this is uh, 0 1 2 3 and 4 now here after j gonna decrease by 1 so j is 2 now that go up and increase the value of i so i become 2 now check the condition 2 less than uh, j value is also 2 so 2 less than 2 the condition is uh, not true so here after that not coincide so control comes to this point so at here 
after reverse array elements. So this on display into the output screen and i value start from 0 and n value is now 5. So 0 less than 5 condition is true. So that go inside after leaving 8 character space this uh, print 8 over 0 position element. So first uh, that print 11. Here after that call an increase value r i. So i become 1 now. Check the condition 1 and uh, n value is 5. So 1 less than 5 that go inside. So after leaving 8 character space that print the value of 1. Position value 7, 7 print. Here after i gonna increase by 1, so i become 2 now. Check the condition 2 less than n value 5, 2 less than 5, condition is 2, so that go inside. So uh, this all leave 8 character space and 8 over out of 2 position, so 2 position 5 is there, so this print. Here after i gonna increase by 1, so i become 2 to 3. Check the condition 3 less than 5, condition is 2, so that go inside. So after leaving 8 character space, so that print uh, 8 over out of 3 position value, so 9 print. Here after I gonna increase by one, so I is four now. Check the condition four less than five. Condition is true, so that coincides. So this only eight character space. So four position, oh uh, well, that print. So final output we have eleven seven five nine. So this is four, right? Okay. So eleven seven five nine four. And here after uh, that out from main function. So this is the drying method of this program. So I hope guys you understand. So thanks for watching. See you next week.